Hello YouTube, this is the G-Shock Beast. <laughs> this is my first video that I'm posting. This G-Shock, I just got it today. Um, well, this is it. It has two lights right here, which I really don't know where they're called, but let's find out. You guys probably know. Yeah, and it, this is a quick review. It's not going to take long, so. I'll do this quick because I have to do something right now. Um, I mean, it has nice colors and everything. It's the G Shock. Let's see. Whoa. My phone, I can't. It's a G Shock uh, G. Let me focus it for you guys. G8900 SC. Of course, like most G Shocks, it's a 20 bar water resistance so yeah it also has a new feature I don't know if it's new but I just learned it today if you hold the G button down you'll see a little LT sign pop out it means auto light so this feature actually allows you to raise your G-Shock up and it'll turn on by itself without you pressing the G button let's take a look or if you turn it this way yeah Turn it that way. Let's do this again. There we go. Um, and if you raise it up too. If you raise it up, wait up. Down. Up. Fail. What the fuck? It's tripping, but you know. It's a pretty good watch. So, I really, if you're. If you're looking for a good watch like this with nice colors and nice features, I recommend this one. There's a lot there's a lot of colors to it. Not just this one. But yeah. So I really don't like the LT button. I don't know why. I prefer to press the middle button when I want to see my light. Oh yeah, and to turn it off, all you have to do is hold it. I just did right now. And it'll automatically come off. So you turn it back on and the LT disappears. So yeah, that's my new G-Shock. Thanks for watching.